First thing that we're gonna do, all right, is, is I'm gonna step inside of the guard. So my foot is gonna come into the center right here, right? My hands are gonna be engaged on the knees so that he can't sit up and go forward, all right? And I'm looking for two grips, right? The first grip is the inside knee grip, and the second grip is gonna be the collar grip, okay? So this is where I wanna be at. So now that I'm on my base, right, and I've established what I want, right, I'm not letting him get what he wants. Okay, so he's looking for Della Heba, he's looking for lots of different things, all right? So as far as the knee cutting goes, once I've established my collar grip, right, I want to lift him up, all right? I need to protect my space right here so that he can't put his knee in and do a knee shield or anything like that. I don't want him knee shielding. I don't want him putting his Della Heba in. So if I lift him up right here, I can block that hole in that area to prevent that, okay? This hand is gonna be shoving the knee to the ground as I lift him up, all right? That's what we're looking for, okay? So, again, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna step into the guard and I'm looking to establish what I want, okay? I'm not letting him establish what he wants. Now, a lot of times, because we just got done working open guards, he's gonna grab his grips. I don't care what he's doing, I'm getting what I want, okay? So, go, Corey, go ahead and establish the grips that you would establish. <coughs> I'm in here, I'm boat, I'm establishing my grips. He's gonna go, look, he went collar sleeve on me. That's okay. All right, I'm not worried about what he's doing. I'm only concerned about what I'm doing, okay? So I'm gonna lift him up, right? I'm gonna shove him over, and I'm gonna put his knee on the ground here, okay? So my knee is coming to the inside, and I'm gonna drop to my hip when I'm doing my knee cut passing, okay? So I'm gonna drop to my hip, so I'm super, super heavy here, right? And I'm looking for his elbow, so the hand that's on the knee, now that I'm controlling it with my leg, it's gonna come to the elbow. He's gonna start framing at this point and trying to come and block that, that's okay. I'm gonna grab the back of this elbow here and I'm gonna complete my knee cut pass, sliding through and controlling in the side control, okay? So it's a basic, basic knee cut pass, all right? But making sure that you get the, the parts of it right, you're gonna be way more successful with it if you follow these small little details, okay? So I'm entering into the guard, I'm looking for hands on the knees, okay? I get my grip, I get my grip, all right? I wanna lift him up, all right? Now watch, when I go to start my knee cut, I turn him down and I push his leg to the ground, all right? That's gonna turn his body to the point where he's on his side where I want him at, okay? He's gonna frame up here. Now I'm looking, I'm dropping my hips. Look, I'm not, I'm not up like this because he can stick his knee in this side there. I'm, I'm down here so he can't get his knee in there, okay? So once I'm in here, now I'm looking for the back of that elbow. All right. Once I'm at the back of that elbow, I'm gonna push his hand across his body as I knee cut through here. Knee cutting, sliding, turning my hips, okay? And I can control in a side control there. All right. His knees are up, entering in, establishing my grips, okay? I got him pulled up, turn him over, drop my hip, right? Looking for the elbow. Pass my knee, pass the arm, and control. <clears throat> basic, basic knee cutting. All right, you got it? Yep. All right, let's break up. Pair up with somebody about our size. We're gonna do that on three. One, two, three.